Hi everyone, welcome to My Chamber TV, the heartbeat of our community. We're back again. We're here every Wednesday at 12.30, live and unrehearsed, very organic here. Today happens to be the first day we're actually bringing food in. I can't wait to tell you about what we have coming your way after our break. But before we get started, I just want to give you a little intro. If you're new to My Chamber TV, we started this several months back to open up this as a platform to all the Chamber of Commerce members. We have presidents of the board, various executive members of the board, business owners coming in and talking about what they do, what their role is as a chamber member, and then for the business owners, what they're doing in the community. The best part is the camaraderie among everybody. And the one commonality that I notice among the chamber members is that they all feel that you need to get involved in your community. You need to join a chamber of commerce or more than one, if that's your choice, and really dig deep and get involved. I cannot tell you how much I have noticed businesses improve just by tapping into the heart of the community through the various social networks, the people that are out there really pounding the pavement in more ways than one when it comes to really networking, setting up different network events, charity organizations, ribbon cutting ceremonies, all kinds of great things. People want to be involved with people. And if you sit home and wish and hope and dream that your business is going to take off, a lot of that is very true. But you know what? Haven't you heard that phrase, gotta have some skin in the game? Well, you do. You have to have some skin in the game. I've already noticed businesses take off just since I've been doing the My Chamber TV. One of the people that we are going to be interviewing, I have the utmost respect for. She's going to be coming out here in just a little bit. She started her own magazine, It's Your Home. And while you're shopping, while you're shopping, see, it's that, that HSN mentality. I always do that, but so forgive me. For those of you that, that know me, know that I did shop on HSN and I was a host there. So every now and again, I'll slip because it was like into my brain. But what I want to tell you about Debbie Dawson and her magazine is she opened up this magazine to the community there are so many advertisers in there, and the reason being is because it's successful. This is her magazine here. My husband and I have written for the magazine with our Defy Aging, and now we have My Chamber TV in this. And it's just a really great way for you to connect. If you want to know who's who, you contact Debbie Dawson. You want to sell your home, you want to buy a home, you contact Debbie Dawson because she's with Remax and she'll do a great job for you. She actually goes above and beyond. So she's going to be coming out. We're going to be talking about her position with the chamber. She has a new group that she's created and I'm not going to burst her thunder. I'm going to wait till she comes on board and she can share that with you. And then I have the most heartwarming story that I couldn't get off the phone the other day. And that was with Nick Agostino. He's with the Pretzel Factory. And it is so cool. Wait till you hear the story behind it. I mean, it's a good old fashioned all American dream come true with him and his wife and his family. And he's the one that brought us food today. So it's going to be really exciting to see. Wait till you see the tray of goodies. So that's just a little bit of a lineup on what's coming on My Chamber TV. And if you're tuning in for the very first time and maybe you've never seen it before and you're thinking, well, how exciting can My Chamber TV be? Trust me, it's been very exciting. We, I wish I had more Wednesdays in a month, I really do, because the feedback we're getting from people, and like yourself, I really do have to extend my thanks, my big kudos to you for supporting My Chamber TV and sharing it over and over and over again on Facebook, because I, I have to give the original big old kudos to John Gaston with Tampa Bay Multimedia. This is his dream coming true. I'm helping him make that dream come true and so are you. So please spread the word. It's all about My Chamber TV and when you go to MyChamberTV.com you can also see the archived shows. Go over to your left, click on to the little button there that says archives. You can see last week's show, 
the show before that. And you can even see the last show that Debbie Dawson and I did here on My Chamber TV. So that is a good little sort of a rundown about what we're doing here at My Chamber TV. I'm very, very excited about the show today because we do have a great lineup and so much more. I don't know if John's going to reveal himself or not since I'm bragging on him and he's not sitting right here. This is my guest chair for my two guests coming. Oh, there he is. We have a new little look here, don't we, John, with the, yep. the three little screens. I'm very impressed. Yep. You did that all by yourself. I know. Isn't that awesome? <laughs> you are awesome. We call him the producer extraordinaire, if you will. Yeah. So hey, what made you put those three screens up like that? Just to have a little bit more uh, versatility? Well, I figured if Fox can do it, I can do it. Aha. Uh -huh. I uh, see. Just one of those things. I see. Jeez, we could actually take one of those screens and put a product up there and we could... No, never mind. I'm just... We, we could. <laughs> we could. Absolutely. Maybe absolutely. we will. Yeah, yes. Yes, you absolutely. Just never know. Hey, you know what I did last night? What'd you do? I went to did the we Marvel wanna... Universe. You live. did? I've been yes. hearing about that. Yep. We were we got the media invite. So it was the coolest thing. <gasps> Where was that? It was at the Tampa Bay Forum. Oh my goodness. Yeah. I bet. What was that all about? Well, it's you, you gotta be a comic person. So and you get and actually all the movies that you've been going around like the Avengers and um, uh, Iron Man and the Hulk. Well, they all come together against their arch enemies. And actually, Spider-Man was in there as well, which is kind of interesting. Oh, my goodness. And so all of Spider-Man's enemies and all of um, the Avengers' enemies all came together. Thor was there. I mean, it was, it was, it was crazy. It was, but technologically, one of the best shows I've ever seen. Really? Oh, yeah. They did a, I mean, they literally flew people. They flew... Uh, uh, cars like the goblin was there and I don't, I don't know if you know who the goblin is but the goblin was there and on his and he was on his flying sled so it was really cool it oh really, really wow cool. yeah my, my one son especially jason would love that because he's a real marvel comic freak when right. it comes to all that stuff had all the the action figures and everything and he in fact i think we still have a lot of the old old comics i wonder if they're worth anything yes they, they are, are. Oh yeah. So, <laughs> yep. But so, yeah, we, uh, we got to go and, and everybody that was sitting around us was either from, um, clear channel or Cox radio or, uh, ABC, CBS, NBC, Fox, actually, uh, a friend of mine, Charlie Belcher was there, him and his daughter, Lindsay Rose, they got right down front and, uh, it was just, it was a really, a really, really cool thing. How fun. Yep. I bet that had yeah. to be really exciting. Oh, wow. it's the bomb. Cool. What else? Anything else going on behind um, the scenes? Well, we I know we told everybody we were launching We Beam TV uh, mm -hmm. July 1st, but we're mm -hmm. going to hold off to August 1st now okay. because there's uh, some new back-end stuff that we just found out that we can do. So, yeah. And oh, and by the way, did everybody see the post? I wonder. Well, I wonder. The, I saw the post. The did you post. want me to? Did you want me to share, or did you want to share? No, go ahead. Absolutely. I, I'm, About I'm totally we, we beam TV. Yep. And if somebody wants to have their own TV show, is yep. that what? Absolutely. Yeah, we're going to be offering you an opportunity to have your own TV show, and we're going to be making the offer. And I'm not sure how long this is going to be because it's going to have to be first come first serve. Because I personally have had a lot of people requesting, well, what, how can we have our own show? And I said, well, we're working on it. We're working on it. So we already have kind of like a VIP list. Yep. So if you want to find out more about it, you'll have to write us here. You can write me, Barbara, at MyChamberTV.com. But here's the scoop. Write this down and start emailing, start calling, whatever you have to do. We are on Facebook. Let us know. We are going to give you four, one, two, three, four. Four shows. How are we going to give that, John? Free. Free. But wait, there's more. Oh, but wait, there's more. If you order right now. <laughs> if you order right now, stop that. <laughs> he's he's picking on And only going to pay me. shipping and handling. It's it. And free shipping and handling. You're so bad. So I told you, you never know what to expect on My Chamber TV because uh, they're always razzing me. You, you work for HSN, <laughs> and we produce the uh, infomercials that they ran on the air normally. 
I know. So, yeah. I know. So we've got a lot, John and I've got a lot of history together with uh, all this uh, crazy but fun TV arena and all of that. So I'm, I'm really sitting in my glory here. And to be able to offer your own TV show for free shows. For yeah. free shows. For free shows. Yep. It's going to be a limited time offer. I don't know how long September that will 1st. be. September 1st. Um, we're going to be launching it September first. So no, no, no. We're we're launching in August. August. And but the the special runs till September first. Till September first. So 1st. August thirty first, done. Okay. So let us yeah. know. Let us get you booked right. because that's going to be. It's going to go pretty quick. It truly yeah. is. And time uh, will fill up quick. Yeah. Yeah. We do yeah. our show. Uh, we just launched our show, Primetime TV. Primetime TV on Mondays at uh, five p.m. Myself and my husband. And uh, we're co-hosting that show to bring you a lot of really good healthy tips, uh, tips on how to live a better quality of life, bringing you the latest cutting edge on alternative healing. We're going to have special guests joining us on that. So I'm giving myself a free little plug, but you know, I was oh, talking- Hey, it's, it's a good show. Uh, it is a good show. You know, I, I tell you, I, I, you know, once we launch and I've started putting everything out on the WeBeam for uh, social media, I put, I actually started your ad yesterday and it, it, it blew up. I know. Uh, so we beam TV, when we started our Facebook page, we start off at like a hundred people, maybe 150. Cause that was all people that knew us. Mm -hmm. I ran that ad and I ran yours and I ran a new other, another uh, promo and we're up to a little over 2000 people now. So and that's how you up. do it. You know, you take one person. It only takes one person to make a difference in yeah. a company or even in the world. Yep. And if you take that dream and really embrace it, put your passion, put your heart and soul into it, you can make that happen. Oh, absolutely. You really can. Absolutely. But it also goes with putting some skin into the game. And can well, I just tell you, you work. Man, put more than skin in the game, John. You're a yeah. real hard worker. Well, it's just, this is my dream. And you know, if you just don't, if you don't do it, I, I'm, I, I don't, I don't want to be 90 or a hundred and going, God, I wish I'd have done that. I know. Cause uh, then you're like, I just, I just don't like being like that. Well, you know, somebody posted something on Facebook. I think it was this morning or yesterday. I think my friend Karen Wagner posted it on Facebook about, um, why put something off when you can do it now? Yeah. Because, and, and, and there's so much truth to that. We do have a tendency to put things off. And when we do, nothing happens. Nothing. But it just seems like when you jump into something that you've dreamed about. Now, this has actually been my dream for 20 years. I've been thinking about this, and I've never lost sight of it. I knew my husband and I would eventually have our own TV show, and voila. I think it was a little divine intervention and a match of enthusiasm with Tampa Bay Multimedia. And me or John never taking no for an answer, I guess. No. I don't know. So here we are. We're very excited. And when John told me what he told me about the new shows that we're going to be doing and getting out there testing the market, we have a list of great ideas that we're going to be putting out here and really helping to grow our community. But our community is worldwide on the web. And that's the beauty of it, to right. be able to not have uh, a necessarily a program on the television as we've grown to know it over the years where you have to be home at a certain time make sure that you're there so that you don't miss it or if you do your TiVo you you know you can do that but imagine be able to take a TV show with you wherever you go on your laptop on your so guess iPhone, what? all that we gotta go pay bills we do already uh, yep you mean we've been bantering back and forth and we've already yep Okay. It's time to pay some bills. It's time to pay some bills. And then when we come back, we are going to have one of the best social butterflies in the community, Miss Debbie Dawson. And we're going to talk about her magazine. We're going to talk about how real estate is absolutely booming in the area. And this new group that she just started about. Remember the welcome wagon? Well, it's not that. It's even better. We'll be there back we after this. The last several years have been confusing and trying for homeowners. Advisors Mortgage and Financial Group was there before the housing crisis, during, and we are still here now advising people of their options and helping them choose the best financial solutions for their family. You do have options, and today's market promises lots of opportunities. We have found that there are a lot of questions out there and misinformation, and we want you to know we have answers. Advisors Mortgage and Financial Group providing solutions today for a better tomorrow. Revolution.
revolutionary in his field, Dr. Bonatti created, perfected, and patented the Bonatti Spine Procedures. Using his genius, Bonatti invented precise tools necessary to minimize surgery, scarring, anesthesia, and recovery. So successful are the Bonatti Spine Procedures, they consistently reflect over 94% patient satisfaction. 45,000 successful procedures have been performed exclusively at our location. Nearly half our patients suffer from failed back and neck surgeries at other facilities. Bonatti succeeds where others fail. Hi, I'm Derek Brooks, former linebacker for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. During my NFL career, I realized the importance of giving back and started my foundation, Derek Brooks Charities. We help Tampa Bay youth prepare for a successful life through our college prep and mentoring programs. Our goal is to see youth excel academically and develop strong characters and be better citizens for tomorrow. To further our mission, we've teamed up with Fun Night, a company that gives members access to thousands of nationwide discounts on products and services they buy every day. These include entertainment, retail purchases, dining and travel. Best of all, 33% of every membership fee goes to the charity of your choice. We love being able to save our supporters money while giving them a unique opportunity to support our charitable work in the community. I invite you to consider using Fun Night to save money and give back to your favorite cause. Visit www.funnight.us to sign up now and get a free 30-day trial. Save money, help others with Fun Night, and support Derrick Brooks Charity. The Bonatti Spine Institute is proud to announce more than a 94% patient reported success rate in over 45,000 patent protected spine surgical procedures. Call us today at 855-267-0483 or visit us at bonatti.com. All my pain is gone, gone, gone. Today I am totally pain free, nothing, no after effect. I'm pain-free, and I have had to take any pain medication. Today I am pain-free for the first time in over a year, and it is so awesome. I only wish I'd known about it earlier. Right now, I am completely without pain. Sitting here in this office right now, pain-free, eager to enjoy the rest of my life. I am feeling great. I feel 100% better like a new person. Today I feel absolutely fantastic. It's just incredible the relief I feel right now. Today I'm completely pain free. During the procedure I literally felt the pain melt away. It was fantastic. I feel so, so good. It took care of my headaches instantly. It's incredible. It's really incredible. It gave me my life back. It's just wonderful. I feel fantastic. It is just absolutely amazing. So I'm hoping to be climbing hills in a few weeks. Mortgages don't need to be complicated. At Norcom, we're here to guide you through the process. By following our tried and true path to success, we make homes happen. To get started, give us a call or apply online. A trusted mortgage consultant will reach out to you to find out what your goals are. Whether you're in the market to purchase a new home or refinance your current home, we are dedicated to helping you achieve your goals. At Norcom, we'll provide a best-in-class customer experience. 
Once a plan is established, your mortgage consultant will analyze your income, assets, and credit profile in order to customize a plan for you. If you're planning on moving in the next few years, we might suggest an adjustable rate mortgage to be the best option for you. If you're a veteran, we'll get you started on a VA loan with 0% down. And if you're thinking long-term, a 30-year fixed loan might be your best fit. Our professionals are up to date on market trends and will help you make the best decision in choosing your rate. After we've found the program that's best for you, we'll then need to collect some information, including pay stubs, bank statements, and tax forms. Our underwriting team steers a loan through the approval process to verify that all the information you've provided is correct. As the underwriting process is taking place, an appraisal is ordered to determine the value of your home. A professional, local appraiser specializing in your area will determine the home's value. The last leg of this journey is closing your loan. While taking care of any last minute details, our closing team will work on scheduling your closing date and location. It's that simple. Thank you for taking some time to walk through the mortgage path with us. Remember, we're always here to answer any questions you may have. It may seem intimidating, but here at Norcom Mortgage, we make homes happen. Hi everyone, welcome back to My Chamber TV, the heartbeat of your community, our community, my community, your community, right? Our community, everybody's <laughs> community. Uh, I was bragging about you earlier, <laughs> and so now I can't wait to introduce to you guys. I've been talking about the magazine, it's your home, and Debbie Dawson started this on her own. How long ago? Oh gosh, um, 2009? Was it? Yeah, it's been and, a while. It, and we've been writing for the magazine shortly so, thereafter. Right. And you just you just flutter around in the community. You want to know what's happening, who's who, called Debbie Dawson. I'm not kidding you. Contact Debbie Dawson. And Debbie is also a licensed real estate associate with Remax. And wow, I was on the phone with her yesterday, and she was talking about how real estate is just booming, booming, booming. You made some serious sales over the weekend, didn't I you? I did. I worked hard this weekend. I get, you work <laughs> hard all the time. You know, you. I, I was talking about this new group that you're starting up, and we were waiting to mention it as your official launch. So we want to talk about that and, you know, a little bit about the magazine, too, because this magazine, it's different than anything else that's out there. It really does have a hometown feel, doesn't it? Isn't that, isn't that what well, your intentions what, yeah, were? It's, that's, that's our tagline, your family, your community, your life. It's your home. Exactly, and you do a hometown so, story. We do hometown stories, yes, every issue. Mm -hmm. And uh, there's a lot of stories about those, the people and businesses in our community. Exactly. It's all about them. It is. It truly is. It's all about you. Um, Debbie is also uh, on the executive board for the Trinity Odessa Chamber, and we've had a slew of the members in here from the Trinity and your secretary, right? Yes. So yeah. what are you finding? That's a, they're fairly new this year. What, they're what's new happening? And it's booming. Um, we have almost over 200 members already, and that's just in a short while, and our goal for the end of the year is 300. Wow. So for a small community, that's, that's a, a, a lot of members. And a lot of those members show up at these different events. They do. Yeah. Gosh. We have a great response, and there's, um, we kind of rotate. There's a breakfast, then a lunch, then a dinner. And uh, we always fill the room. And there's always something, always something to go to. And there, everybody is so upbeat and fun, and everybody knows everybody. What, what do you find talking about the chamber? Because I know you've been a chamber member for a long time. And what do you find that really is so very helpful with the chamber, this particular chamber that you're involved with? It's really about networking and getting to know people. People like to do business with people they know and like. And, and helping the community. It's not just about what the business that it gets for you, it's also what you can do for our community too. That's where we started the Cash Mob West Pasco, you know, helping the small businesses in our community. I saw a need for that years ago. Um, we had so many businesses that were struggling. Mm -hmm. And that's where we put that group together. We're on our 23rd Cash Mob now. Is it that many? Mm -hmm. I remember when you started about it, because Debbie and I go back quite a little ways and we've become not only friends, but business colleagues as well. And when we were just talking as girlfriends and you were just so excited about start, starting that cash mob, tell everybody how that actually works because our next guest got caught up in the cash mob. Yes, we mobbed. We <laughs> mobbed Penguin Pretzel Factory last a couple weeks ago. That was our last, our 22nd mob. And how it works is we all, a group of us get together and we all come armed with a $10 bill and nobody knows who we're going to hit. 
and we hit a local business in West Pasco. And then afterwards, we go to a small mom and pop restaurant and network there, and we bring revenue into both places of business. So we hit two places of business once a month on a Saturday, 10 a.m. we all meet. Now, and that's grown. You started out with, what would you say, how, when you first launched this? We actually, we get anywhere from 35 to 75 people at Do every really? mobbing. Yes. Wow. And it's, it's a different crowd each time. Sometimes a lot of the same people, Valerie Wilson, actually helps me do it each week too and we've got a lot of people that come out each and every week and last um, last map we mobbed the Center for Independence which we always ask has anybody ever heard of the place we're mobbing you know after the fact when we're at networking and usually 75 to 90 percent of the people have never heard of the business that we're mobbing and this is a local business in town in West Pasco Wow so it, it's it's just a tremendous um, boost in revenue for the businesses we've done anywhere from 400 to over two thousand dollars in less than an hour in that's one just cash for one month? yeah and that's just for the business then we go to the restaurant and that's usually anywhere from 200 to a thousand dollars that we do in the restaurant depending on how many people um show up at each mob and they're it's all volunteer and you just never know who's going to show up in the parking lot and we're getting ready this saturday we'll be doing another one we're all meeting at the market on main off of downtown newport ritchie so we should be getting a good crowd there too. You know, this is so great to be able to give back like that in the community. And I've often said, if it's going to be, it's up to me. You mm -hmm. know, and look what you've done. I mean, for a business that could be struggling, two hundred dollars can make all the difference. But if it can go upwards, close to a thousand or two thousand dollars, that can actually springboard a business and keep them going. Keep them going. They may be getting ready to consider closing their doors. And we all know what kind of economy we've had from time to time. So gosh darn it, get out there in your community. Join a chamber, whatever chamber. It doesn't matter where. Get involved with your community. Uh, since I left uh, TV, well, sort of left TV from the Home Shopping Network, uh, I did network a little bit in the community. I had, I had to practice talking in front of people. <laughs> If oh, you no, can, not you. Yeah, right. <laughs> my 30-second little elevator yeah. speech, you know, with my sweaty palms and my dry throat. It was totally different than talking to a camera. But um, I, I really found that, that, and I wasn't a member at the chamber at, at the time, but I was networking with women's groups. And there's just a different connection when you can really be face-to-face. -face. You can read a person's eye pre predicates, you can read their body language, and getting back to that no like trust factor, then when you need something, oh my goodness, how many times have I called you about air conditioners lately? Oh yeah. <laughs> and she was just rattling them off one right after another. So it helps if you know somebody that knows a business that does have you a good reputation, and it could probably save you a lot of dollars in the in the long run. Really. Oh, absolutely. And our magazine too. If we do get mm -hmm. complaints against a company, we just ask them. You know, we'd rather not have you as a sponsor of the magazine. Mm -hmm. We've only had to let two go. Really? Yeah. But that's other than that, too bad. every single business that's in It's Your Home magazine, I would recommend to you or even my mother. See, so, and there's so a lot to be said for that. Well, you do your homework. You really do. And you've got a good feel for people. You've got a good feel for businesses. Mm -hmm. And I can't tell you how tickled I am that you're finally on the show with us. I know. I thank mean, you. I've seen more of you this month right. than I have in the last year. That's true. She, you're that's just true. so busy. I mean, a mom of how many children? Four. Four kids. How many grandchildren? Four. And your mom and your grandma, who's going to be turning? A hundred years old this month. Amazing, five generations. That is so beautiful. And a huge party in store for her, so. Oh, that's so neat. And you, I mean, you are really busy with your family, your magazine, the real estate company, but you always find a way to get out there return phone calls, get with people who are really in need of something, and that's appreciated. And if we can just clone you, that would be really oh, that great. Would be nice. We put that advertisement in here. Let's clone Debbie Dawes. <laughs> oh, don't forget the Newcomers Club now. Now that's, wow, where that's, I, that's yeah. exactly where I was going now. You came up with this phenomenal idea, just like the cash mob. We were on the phone. Oh, and I'm going to do this and this. I'm going to let you tell them exactly what it is, because this is like official news. Well, this is the Newcomers Club. It's going to be Welcome to Trinity. We're going to start our first, our first chapter. And it's just welcoming people to the neighborhood. You know, you have new people that come in and they're looking for businesses or, you know, they need a new dentist. They, they, mm -hmm. they need everything. Right. 
Um, and just some people don't know anybody in the area, so it's just getting them you know, familiarized and making new friends. So we're going to be handing out swag bags, gifts from all of our local businesses, and having get-togethers and so, um, to meet the people that are new to our neighborhood. What's a swag bag? A swag bag is, is a that. fancy word for a bag filled with gifts. Filled with gifts. I love it. Remember the old, old days with the uh, welcome wagon? Are right. they even still around? I have no idea. I know they had I don't see them, but I have no idea. And it was just, I actually started it on Facebook, and wow, what a response. So many people I saw from that. the community I are saw willing, that. able, and ready to, yes. to get those bags filled. So yes, I wanted to volunteer. Wonderful. I was yes. trying to think, well, maybe I need to clone myself to do all yeah. this volunteer, <laughs> but really you just come up with these great ideas for the community and they work. I've yet to see nothing. I, I've never seen anything that you've started in the community not work. Oh, and this girl works day and night and it's so very exciting. So with this newcomers club, how do people um, get involved? Um, you're going to be putting it in your magazine, right? Yes, we'll be putting in the magazine and then we're just putting everything together right now and we do have, we're asking for community liaisons that want to go out there and, and help with this and we've got quite a response so far. So we'll have a meeting and see how we can get the swag bags out to the community and start setting up places to, to meet with the new people. And so, so with the Chamber of Commerce, they're gonna play a really big part with all the newcomers coming into town as well, I'm guessing. Yeah, I'm hoping so. Mm -hmm. So we'll, we'll see how that goes. And yeah, welcome to the neighborhood. I love welcome it. Welcome to Trinity. It's just so nice to, to have people feel welcome and then they, they feel like they already know somebody, you know, and that kind of thing. So. It's great. Um, any special events coming up with the Chamber that you can think of that you want to just... Well, we do. We have um, the night in Monte Carlo. That's one of our big fundraisers. Um, that will be over at the Verizon Center in Newport Ritchie. Okay. And that is August 5th. And you can get tickets. You can go to the website uh, trinityodessa.com for information on that. Cool. Cool. So that's all I know of so far. Good. Good. Yeah. We well, just had it. We just had a big luncheon. That room was packed for that over at Fox Hollow. So. Oh, that's right. I remember that. Yeah, yes. That, that was yes. good. We had celebration of lights. Came yes. out there yes. and told us all about what they have in store for us during the holidays. And they do. And I think they were on the we, show too. Yeah. Wasn't Joe Alpine? Yep. They yes. were here a couple of weeks ago, yep. and then we saw them at the events locally at Fiddler's Green. We did right. a little interview with them there. So. Even though the town and the community is coming to us here at My Chamber TV, we're getting out on the streets and inter interviewing people too. So you just never know where we may show up with a candid camera in right. our hands, you know, to find out what's happening in the community. Well, it's no different than advertising, but in a sense, it is because of that personal contact right. in getting with people. What do you think of My Chamber TV? I love it. I think this is a great idea. It's crazy good, isn't it? Yeah. Crazy good. It's very good. It's just, you know, get, getting everybody to know everybody in the neighborhood. That's, I know. It's wonderful. It's awesome. Well, I want to thank you. I'm getting the sign that we're going okay. to be taking a quick little break. And when we come back, we're going to have the pretzel <gasps> factory. Yes, and this is where we mobbed. And, and actually, they are delicious. I, I have can't to, wait. I have to say, I'm so happy that Nick was able to come out here and share it with you. Me so. too. He's a delight. You'll love it. Thank you, love. I thank will see you, you again. Okay. All right, stick around Thank for you. you know what. We'll be right Your back pretzels. after this. <laughs> the last several years have been confusing and trying for homeowners. Advisors Mortgage and Financial Group was there before the housing crisis, during, and we are still here now advising people of their options and helping them choose the best financial solutions for their family. You do have options, and today's market promises lots of opportunities. We have found that there are a lot of questions out there and misinformation, and we want you to know we have answers. Advisors Mortgage and Financial Group providing solutions today for a better tomorrow. Revolutionary in his field, Dr. Benatti created, perfected, and patented the Benatti Spine Procedures. Using his genius, Benatti invented precise tools necessary to minimize surgery, scarring, anesthesia, and recovery. So successful are the Benatti Spine Procedures, they consistently reflect over 94% patient satisfaction. 45,000 successful procedures have been performed exclusively at our location. Nearly half our patients suffer from failed back and neck surgeries at other facilities. Benatti succeeds where others fail. Hi, I'm Derek Brooks, former linebacker for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. During my NFL career, I realized the importance of giving back and started my foundation, Derek Brooks Charities. We help Tampa Bay youth prepare for a successful life 
through our college prep and mentoring programs. Our goal is to see youth excel academically and develop strong characters and be better citizens for tomorrow. To further our mission, we've teamed up with Fun Night, a company that gives members access to thousands of nationwide discounts on products and services they buy every day. These include entertainment, retail purchases, dining, and travel. Best of all, 33% of every membership fee goes to the charity of your choice. We love being able to save our supporters money while giving them a unique opportunity to support our charitable work in the community. I invite you to consider using Fun Night to save money and give back to your favorite cause. Visit www.funnight.us to sign up now and get a free 30-day trial. Save money, help others with Fun Night, and support Derrick Brooks Charity. The Bonatti Spine Institute is proud to announce more than a 94% patient reported success rate in over 45,000 patent protected spine surgical procedures. Call us today at 855-267-0483 or visit us at bonatti.com. All my pain is gone, gone, gone. Today I am totally pain free, nothing, no after effect. I'm pain-free, and I have had to take any pain medication. Today I am pain-free for the first time in over a year, and it is so awesome. I only wish I'd known about it earlier. Right now, I am completely without pain. Sitting here in this office right now, pain-free, eager to enjoy the rest of my life. I am feeling great. I feel 100% better like a new person. Today I feel absolutely fantastic. It's just incredible the relief I feel right now. Today I'm completely pain free. During the procedure I literally felt the pain melt away. It was fantastic. I feel so, so good. It took care of my headaches instantly. It's incredible. It's really incredible. It gave me my life back. It's just wonderful. I feel fantastic. It is just absolutely amazing. So I'm hoping to be climbing hills in a few weeks. Mortgages don't need to be complicated. At Norcom, we're here to guide you through the process. By following our tried and true path to success, we make homes happen. To get started, give us a call or apply online. A trusted mortgage consultant will reach out to you to find out what your goals are. Whether you're in the market to purchase a new home or refinance your current home, we are dedicated to helping you achieve your goals. At Norcom, we'll provide a best-in-class customer experience. Once a plan is established, your mortgage consultant will analyze your income, assets, and credit profile in order to customize a plan for you. If you're planning on moving in the next few years, we might suggest an adjustable rate mortgage to be the best option for you. If you're a veteran, we'll get you started on a VA loan with 0% down. And if you're thinking long-term, a 30-year fixed loan might be your best fit. Our professionals are up to date on market trends and will help you make the best decision in choosing your rate. After we've found the program that's best for you, we'll then need to collect some information, including pay stubs, bank statements, and tax forms. Our underwriting team steers a loan through the approval process to verify that all the information you've provided is correct. As the underwriting process is taking place, an appraisal is ordered to determine the value of your home. A professional, local appraiser specializing in your area will determine the home's value. The last leg of this journey is closing your loan. While taking care of any last minute details, our closing team will work on scheduling your closing date and location. It's that simple. 
thank you for taking some time to walk through the mortgage path with us. Remember, we're always here to answer any questions you may have. It may seem intimidating, but here at Norcom Mortgage, we make homes happen. Hi everyone, welcome back to My Chamber TV, the heartbeat of your community. I'm your host, Barbara Marville Kelly, and I've been bragging and talking about Nick Agostino and the Pretzel Factory. I am so excited. I don't know who wanted to stay on the phone the other night during our interview, you or me, because we were just having a blast. Yeah, I we? felt like I'd known you for years. Isn't that the truth? Well, yeah. you know, you've got an all American story. And that was one of the big reasons why I wanted to bring you on. Plus, you were referred by Debbie Dawson. And if Debbie Dawson says this is who you got to have on, this is who you've got to have on. And so I want you to share with everybody, how did this all come about? What were you doing before? Okay. And then about the aha moment that your wife had. Yeah. Well, for a number of years, um, I owned a uh, maintenance and service company for fast food restaurant chains. And I traveled all over from the Tampa Bay area where we uh, live and own a home, all the way up to New Orleans. And we had an apartment in Tallahassee, and it was constant going. And you know, my wife got crazy on the road a lot, trying to spend time with the family. We'd have to be on the road, and finally, you know, it was several weeks a month. Finally, she's like, "This has got to stop. I know we're doing well and we're paying the bills, but we got to do something else." So she said, "I'm going to make pretzels," and I was like okay, you know, <laughs> make pretzels, go ahead. I didn't even know she could do it, you know. And, and um, I was, I remember one night, it was a stormy night, and I was in Baton Rouge on a roof of a fast food restaurant, and there was some problems with the vent hood, and it was storming out, and I'm like, oh my. And she calls me up in the middle of the night, I can't sleep. Um, I, I got all these ingredients together, I'm making pretzels tomorrow morning. <laughs> and I was just like, what, what? Okay, whatever, I'll see you next week, you know. And I came home and, and the kids were like, oh, dad, you don't know. Look at the kitchen. There's flour everywhere. And, I love and it. all the, 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 their friends were over and they've been eating pretzels you know, for two weeks straight. And she worked on it, worked on it. And six months went by and she said, I got it, Nick. Look, look at this. I got it. This is it. This is it. And, and, and was that the first one? That, that was she, the first that one. Was the Just one. a plain salt pretzel. That was it. And she said, I'm, I'm making it a different shape because I want it to be different than the regular stuff you get at the malls and all that mass produced. I said, fine. She said, now go sell it. And I had always been a salesman for our own business. Mm -hmm. So I went and, and uh, went to Mosey in Tampa at the Museum of Science and Industry. And, and they loved it. And they were like, well, you guys got to put a kiosk in. So we did that for a, a year or two, just a couple of months a year. And kind of did it on the side while I was making the transition from one business to the next. Mm -hmm. And uh, then finally, uh, we decided to really step up and say, you know, we're going to have to make a move soon. And that was about the time that Bush Gardens got wind of us. And uh, they came on the Mosey and they said, this is a fabulous product. We want you at some of our festivals, at Bands Brew and Barbecue and, and uh, Viva La Musica and all these different things that they were having. So we began working with them and, and it, it became too much with the two businesses. So I started selling the, the, the equipment off, sold the whole business and we dove into this full time. And uh, at one point my wife said, you know, we're going to open up a shop and, and we're not just going to wholesale and do do uh, kiosk work and, and special events at Bush Gardens whenever. We're going to open a shop. We're going to do this full time. And I again, I said, OK, okay you know, <laughs> and I was just kind of going with it. You know, it felt like a zombie and just kind of whatever after working so many long hours and all that traveling. And we were starting to have fun. The whole family's getting involved. You know, I have children aging from uh, 11 all the way to 18. And they were all as four of them, my, my three older boys and, and then my, my little girl. and where everybody was involved, you know, rolling and doing and making the pretzels. Well, the night before we were going to open up our location on uh, 8521 Old County Road 54 in Newport Ritchie, she woke me up again in the middle of the night. She uh -oh. said, we're making stuffed pretzels. Oh, and that's my what we gosh. And I this. said, you got to be kidding me. And she was like, no, no, no. I said, I thought we were just going to have this. And she said, no, <laughs> we're going to have this. And so I said, yeah, I got nervous because I'm like, I'm all ready to roll with this. 
Today's opening day, she ran to the store, she gets ingredients, she starts making stuff, throwing it around, trash the kitchen, and, and boom, we open up. And so and now we have the stuffed. Oh mm -hmm. my goodness. This is, ooh, this, this looks This is really the stuffed spinach and feta. Stuffed pin, spinach and feta, how yummy. And then you also have a, a matching dip. Yes, a cucumber dill dip sauce, so it goes great with the spinach ooh, and feta. And, and we have so many sandwiches. This one this is one a here. chicken, bacon, ranch, and cheese. This incidentally is Charlie Belch's favorite sandwich whenever he comes in the store. I love it. Yeah, he came in uh, several months back and just kind of, you know, came in, gave, gave us a little heads up call and said, I'm going to come in, I want to check you guys out. I said, well, great, Charlie Belch of Fox 13, good day Tampa Bay. You know, I see it all the time. So he he came in and he had some, he had this, he had the dark chocolate. Yum. He had the chicken, bacon, ranch, and cheese. They had some regular pretzels. And then um, I'd say about 15, 20 minutes later, before he got back to the studios in Tampa, the producer called me and said, Charlie's on the other line. He's in the van. He can't believe how delicious this stuff is. He wants to do a live show from your place. And, I uh, can't it wait. It was great. It was great. And then uh, he, uh, he did the show a couple of months back, and we had a great time. And, and uh, ever since then, it's been going real well. We've been busy. We've been working hard, and the whole family's involved. And that's and what it takes is working hard. You know, I was just cutting into this because a lot of times, Pretzels, um, they can be a little harder and crunchier and harder to chew, but this just sliced right through it. Do you mind if I just oh, have a little yourself. taste? Yeah. I have been waiting for the last half hour. Let me just check this out. You can go ahead and talk. Okay. Yeah, well, a couple weeks ago, you, mm. you just had Debbie on, and uh, they did the cash mm. mob, and that, that was so much fun. We had the best time, and, and uh, they came in. Actually, one gentleman trickled in, and and he was wearing his shirt it said cash mob and i went okay look at that and he said there's a bunch more coming you know we were just across the street and i said wow this is great okay and they came and they came and such great people a lot met, met a lot of new friends and and as I, I was telling you earlier we work so hard in small business and i know you and do. we're constantly working hours now we don't meet anybody we don't spend any time sure with, but there's so many people tapped into the community like debbie and 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 the, the chamber and and these cash mob groups and all these different groups well when you start meeting these people i mean the first year we haven't even been a year at this place so laser focused on just making sure everything is right. Everything right. is right. And people are coming in the door, oh, do this, join that, buy this, advertise here. I'm like, well, just leave me alone. I have no time. I just got to work. <laughs> I got to think pretzels. Right. And then pretzels. finally people like Debbie, you know, you start to meet and you say, well, you know what? There's something different about this person. They're, they're real. They're nice. You know, and then other people come in and invite you to a, to a group with the chamber. Then you start meeting like-minded people, yes. and you say, wow, these people get me, I get them. They're all hard work, and what a great community. And now we're just starting to get involved, just now starting to get involved with all these things after about a year. It's, and look at how everything is just mushrooming for you. And yeah, you know, it, and would you, what would you say, g give us a one-liner on your philosophy, something that's inspiring and motivating to somebody out there that might be thinking about giving up on their business. Follow your dreams. I mean, it, it sounds like a cliche. It's it's true. It's true. Yeah. And, and, you know, if you if you put your nose to the stone, if you really, 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 really work hard, have a good vision, and you keep your integrity and you do right by people, it it works. It will work. It will come through. And and, and I know it. I know it firsthand. Well, you know, it, it, and it all comes back to really walking your talk. I mm. mean, you and your wife and your family. I mean, your children are involved yeah. as well. So obviously you want to have a high standard of excellence. You're mm -hmm. offering food to the community. And you know what? Sometimes there really isn't a second chance, sometimes, mm -hmm. but they're either gonna like it or they're not. Can I just tell you, and I am so nitpicky when it comes to food because I'm always watching my fat ingredients and all that. This is so delicious and you can just taste the homemade feeling to it well, and all the you. love Appreciate that you put into it. Yeah, it. that's the secret ingredient. Yeah, it, it really <laughs> is. And I, I gotta tell you guys, okay, take a look. These aren't just stuffed a little bit. I wish you could come really close. <laughs> I wish I could hand this to you. Look at that. I mean, it is really stuffed to the brim. Mm -hmm. So you haven't really skimped on that. And a lot of times businesses will have to do that in order to cut a few corners, maybe mm -hmm. if they aren't getting out into the community and networking and getting the word out, how would people know of you? Like what Debbie was saying earlier, that she, there's a high percentages of, of businesses 
it, right in our own community mm -hmm. that other people that people don't, don't even, even know, know about. about. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you know, with the cost of advertising today mm -hmm. and and everything, this is why I love what we're doing here as part of our community that mm -hmm. goes the full Tampa Bay area. I mean, I feel very blessed to be able to do this. What do you think about My Chamber TV? I think this is great. <laughs> I'm excited about this. I hope we can get together more often. We I want to bring more stuff and show you more things. And it's this has been great. I mean, I, I really appreciate it. I appreciate it being thought of. And uh, like I said, we're working hard. Everything is, you know, it's all made fresh, just like you said. You that, know, and, what time? Well, you must start off I start early. early. I'm putting dough up at uh, 6, 6.30 in the morning. Oh, my goodness. And uh, we're, we're putting, and then we're baking all day long. It's baked, not fried, and it's all fresh, and we're making it all day long. But the blessings, are, like you're saying, the hard work's paying off. We're number one restaurant now in all of Newport Ritchie on TripAdvisor. Really? 174 restaurants in the area. Wow. So all that has been in the past couple of months. It's, you know, just put out a good product, work hard, and, and you got it's true. it. You know? It's really true. It's the Penguin Pretzel Factory, and it's at 8521 Old County Road 54 in Newport, Ritchie. This is their little menu. Can I, I just have to read some of these, some of these little tidbits because they sound so good. Well, I just tasted the spinach and feta. That was wonderful. That's called the Emperor. The Royal is pepperoni and mozzarella. The flipper is bacon cheddar. The king is chicken bacon ranch and cheese. The blue, oh yum, listen to this. Portobello mushrooms and provolone. Oh, you've got cheesy broccoli. You've got buffalo chicken and cheese. I mean, the list goes on and on. Yep. And you also have stuffed desserts, which I find very interesting. Listen to the stuffing. These are really affordable. They're under $3. Are yes. you kidding me? <laughs> White chocolate, peanut butter chocolate, Oreo, apple pie, Nutella, cherry, strawberry, chocolate. Yum. What's inside this one? This one here. This mm. is, uh, I'll break it open so oh, good. you can see. Okay. This one here. I want to see what's inside Is that. the dark chocolate. Oh, look that at that. stuff with dark chocolate. And again, look at all that chocolate. That is amazing. Yeah. I mean, you didn't even skimp on the chocolate. Either. Oh, I you think can't. that's tasty. <laughs> it's really good. <laughs> Wait a minute. I, have, I, can't, I can't help myself, really. It's baked, I, I not to, fried. <laughs> it's baked, not fried. We can do this. Debbie, we can do this. Come on out here and grab a piece. Mm -mm. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Where's my coffee? <laughs> John, where's my coffee? Come on, try, John. Try this. John, come on out here and grab some of this. Oh my what? goodness, this is so good. Is it good? It's delicious. Mm. Try, it's try, mm. try dipping in that cucumber dill with your, the, uh, the spinach, with your spinach and feta. That's what I had last time. Mm. That is, yeah, mm. that that's is really good. Ooh, let me do that. Mm. <laughs> this is so good. Pardon me while we stuff ourselves. Oh, help yourself. Have you had this before? You have? I have yeah. it. Mm. Oh you had this one? Yes, I had that at the cash mouth. That and then the, the vegetable, the roasted vegetable. Oh yeah, Ooh, yeah, that's the that rookery. Delicious. Mm -hmm. And if you notice, all the names have to do with mm -hmm. penguins. Mm -hmm. You know, with the theme. Mm -hmm. How cute is that? Oh, we're having fun Very with good. it. We are having fun. Isn't this great? It's delicious. This was a good it's recommendation from well, you. Good. Well, See? Thank you for thinking. Now you're of not us. the best cast secret anymore. Ah! <laughs> the secret good. is out. It's all about. This is where you get pretzels. I tell you, it's all about pretzels. I never thought pretzels could taste so good. Look at the mm -hmm. size of these. I mean, those are huge, and just so tasty. You'll have to definitely try them. Well, I want to thank you, Debbie, and I think we have a break coming up here in just a little bit, do we, John? Right now. Right now, as a matter of fact. Okay, kids, you're going to come back, right? Absolutely. Yeah, I know you're going to come back. Yes. Thank Absolutely. you, and I, I, I'm going to be placing an order, ah, a nice little tray. Yes, when my kids come down, great. they're going to go crazy for this. And you love. We'll Thank see you. you again. Yes. And we're going to stick Thank around. You. We're going to eat pretzels. And we're going <laughs> to eat during the break, and we'll be right back with a few more messages. So stay right where you are. You're at My Chamber TV. Mortgages don't need to be complicated. At Norcom, we're here to guide you through the process. By following our tried and true path to success, we make homes happen. To get started, give us a call or apply online. A trusted mortgage consultant will reach out to you to find out what your goals are. Whether you're in the market to purchase a new home or refinance your current home, we are dedicated to helping you achieve your goals. At Norcom, we'll provide a best-in-class customer experience. Once a plan is established, your mortgage consultant will analyze your income, assets, and credit profile in order to customize a plan for you. If you're planning on moving in the next few years, we might suggest an adjustable rate mortgage to be the best option for you. 
If you're a veteran, we'll get you started on a VA loan with 0% down. And if you're thinking long-term, a 30-year fixed loan might be your best fit. Our professionals are up to date on market trends and will help you make the best decision in choosing your rate. After we've found the program that's best for you, we'll then need to collect some information, including pay stubs, bank statements, and tax forms. Our underwriting team steers a loan through the approval process to verify that all the information you've provided is correct. As the underwriting process is taking place, an appraisal is ordered to determine the value of your home. A professional, local appraiser specializing in your area will determine the home's value. The last leg of this journey is closing your loan. While taking care of any last minute details, our closing team will work on scheduling your closing date and location. It's that simple. Thank you for taking some time to walk through the mortgage path with us. Remember, we're always here to answer any questions you may have. It may seem intimidating, but here at Norcom Mortgage, we make homes happen. The last several years have been confusing and trying for homeowners. Advisors Mortgage and Financial Group was there before the housing crisis, during, and we are still here now advising people of their options and helping them choose the best financial solutions for their family. You do have options and today's market promises lots of opportunities. We have found that there are a lot of questions out there and misinformation and we want you to know we have answers. Advisors Mortgage and Financial Group providing solutions today for a better tomorrow. Revolutionary in his field, Dr. Bonatti created, perfected, and patented the Bonatti Spine Procedures. Using his genius, Bonatti invented precise tools necessary to minimize surgery, scarring, anesthesia, and recovery. So successful are the Bonatti Spine Procedures, they consistently reflect over 94% patient satisfaction. 45,000 successful procedures have been performed exclusively at our location. Nearly half our patients suffer from failed back and neck surgeries at other facilities. Bonatti succeeds where others fail. Hi, I'm Derek Brooks, former linebacker for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. During my NFL career, I realized the importance of giving back and started my foundation, Derek Brooks Charities. We help Tampa Bay youth prepare for a successful life through our college prep and mentoring programs. Our goal is to see youth excel academically and develop strong characters and be better citizens for tomorrow. To further our mission, we've teamed up with Fun Night a company that gives members access to thousands of nationwide discounts on products and services they buy every day. These include entertainment, retail purchases, dining, and travel. Best of all, 33% of every membership fee goes to the charity of your choice. We love being able to save our supporters money while giving them a unique opportunity to support our charitable work in the community. I invite you to consider using Fun Night to save money and give back to your favorite cause. Visit www.funnight.us to sign up now and get a free 30-day trial. Save money, help others with Fun Night, and support Derrick Brooks Charity. The Bonatti Spine Institute is proud to announce more than a 94% patient reported success rate in over 45,000 patent protected spine surgical procedures. Call us today at 855-267-0483 or visit us at bonatti.com. All my pain is gone, gone, gone. Today I am totally pain free, nothing, no after effect. I'm pain free and I have had to take any pain medication. Today I am pain free for the first time in over a year and it is so awesome. I only wish I'd known about it earlier. Right now I am completely without pain. Sitting here in this office right now, pain-free, eager to enjoy the rest of my life. I am feeling great. I feel 100% better like a new person. Today I feel 
absolutely fantastic. It's just incredible the relief I feel right now. Today I'm completely pain free. Now, during the procedure, I literally felt the pain melt away. It was fantastic. I feel so, so good. It took care of my headaches instantly. It's incredible. It's really incredible. It gave me my life back. It's just wonderful. I feel fantastic. It is just absolutely amazing. So I'm hoping to be climbing hills in a few weeks. Mortgages don't need to be complicated. At Norcom, we're here to guide you through the process. By following our tried and true path to success, we make homes happen. To get started, give us a call or apply online. A trusted mortgage consultant will reach out to you to find out what your goals are. Whether you're in the market to purchase a new home or refinance your current home, we are dedicated to helping you achieve your goals. At Norcom, we'll provide a best-in-class customer experience. Once a plan is established, your mortgage consultant will analyze your income, assets, and credit profile in order to customize a plan for you. If you're planning on moving in the next few years, we might suggest an adjustable rate mortgage to be the best option for you. If you're a veteran, we'll get you started on a VA loan with 0% down. And if you're thinking long-term, a 30-year fixed loan might be your best fit. Our professionals are up to date on market trends and will help you make the best decision in choosing your rate. After we've found the program that's best for you, we'll then need to collect some information, including pay stubs, bank statements, and tax forms. Our underwriting team steers a loan through the approval process to verify that all the information you've provided is correct. As the underwriting process is taking place, an appraisal is ordered to determine the value of your home. A professional, local appraiser specializing in your area will determine the home's value. The last leg of this journey is closing your loan. While taking care of any last minute details, our closing team will work on scheduling your closing date and location. It's that simple. Thank you for taking some time to walk through the mortgage path with us. Remember, we're always here to answer any questions you may have. It may seem intimidating, but here at Norcom Mortgage, we make homes happen. Hi everyone, welcome back into My Chamber TV. I was just saying during the break, how can somebody have so much fun with what we're doing here at My Chamber TV? Well, speaking of more fun, we have our producer, John Gaston, who's going to come from behind the scenes here at any given split. Ah, there he is. I'm here. Hello. What's up? Did you have something that you wanted to talk about? Yeah, you know, uh, I don't get on a soapbox much, but I'm gonna get on one here. Uh, we have we have a, a son that's that is uh, special needs, mm -hmm. and he's has a he's what called fragile X, which is in the autistic autism world. Mm -hmm. So he's been in he's been in the Pinellas County School, and I know I'm not bashing the Pinellas County School okay. system because they have been awesome. Mm -hmm. Okay, but we needed something to just kind of take it to another level for him. So what we have found is Pepin Academies mm. now. Pepin Academies has been around for, I think, about 11, 12 years, and they've okay. been only in Hillsboro. They have finally opened up in Pasco. Really? So if, if you have <sighs> a, a child that has special needs, not emotional, mm -hmm. but special needs, mm -hmm. um, this they are accepting um, students right now. Oh, that's amazing, and John. And they're free. It's, it's no tuition. Mm. So they're not asking for money. That's amazing. But uh, yeah, we we just found out yesterday that uh, Cage is in, and that's cool. my youngest, and it is awesome because the 
I went over and filmed a video with my buddy Dave, and we did a uh, um, uh, end of the year a big celebration for for them and the man who backs this is if you if if the name is familiar it's because it's it's tom pepin pepin uh distributors over mm-hmm. in tampa mm. one of the, i think he's like one of the largest um bud dealers or bud distributors in the state of florida so awesome guy i mean he's got a big heart he backs the whole thing and and, and it's just a great great school so dave and i went over there and and the kids it, it, it is so it's kind of like what we're going through now if you don't know my son and you first meet him you're like oh there's nothing wrong with him but then if you're around for a while you go oh i see it mm-hmm. so but we went over there in the in the realm that they're in that that's going on over there is you look at the same kids going like mine I'm going why well, you just you just don't see it sure until you know what they've got going on and then there's the the full spectrum whether it's full blown you you definitely know I mean it's like wow I mean it's it's and they hmm. treat I love the I love the analogy that the lady gave us yesterday um uh they, they don't treat anybody equal because you're not equal. Because everybody's got their own. Everybody needs person. their special yeah. thing, and that's what special they do. Needs. Is they work that special need for every sure. child. Sure. And it just blew me away that how well these kids over in in Tampa were doing. So after I did it, I, I told the lady over there. I said, "Oh, yeah, you know, if you get one of these in Pinellas, I'm all there. I'm, I'm, I, you've got a hunt. You get the biggest supporter, and uh, I guess Pinellas is." They're still working out with Pinellas, but Pasco said, absolutely. So um, the school is only like 10, 15 minutes away from my wife. So it's like, boom. You know, it's, so we got Perfect. accepted yesterday. But it is a, awesome. I mean, I cannot stress how good of a school this is. You know, there so. is, that is so great. And that is definitely worth you getting up on your soapbox about oh, yeah. because you have a personal interest. And, you know, this is the kind of information that we want to get out to the community. That's why we're branding My Chamber TV and We Beam TV and everything that we do right here in Tarpon Springs, Florida at your studio, Tampa Bay Multimedia. That's wonderful, John. Uh, it's, 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 and, you know, we took Cage with us because he had to be there part of the interview. Mm-hmm. When he left, that child, I've never seen him that relieved. Did, did he like it? Oh, yeah. Oh. I mean, and the way they structured the whole, I mean, the school we had him in, and it's mm-hmm. our choice to put him in there, was a tough school. I mm-hmm. mean, you had sure. to really, and they're not really designed to mm-hmm. work with special needs. Now they have them. Mm-hmm. They can't turn them away. But the way they the way they really structured it, they kept him told, but that, that poor kid, that kid was getting demerits. Because when you forget to sign your homework, or if you don't turn your homework in the, at the beginning of the class and at the end, you get a demerit. So, so many demerits, you get a walk. And mm. it was like, he was always like, because that's part of, that's part of his development, whole nine yards is he just, organization is not, a, is not the strongest thing. Mm-hmm. But when we left yesterday, he's like, I can't wait to start school. He's oh, never said that. That's major. Never said that. That is really he's major. He's always like, well, I gotta start school. Yeah. And then, you know, he just, well, I don't feel good. You know, that whole typical kid thing, you know, like, I don't want to go to school type of thing. But I can't say good enough for Pepin Academy. Oh, They're that's awesome. great. Do we have a phone number handy that we can give? Um, yeah, we do. We can. Uh, they can get them at 727-233-2961, or you can go to their website, pepinacademies.com. Perfect. And Thank you. And you can click on the Pasco link, and uh, it shows it. It's it's. The new school is in a plaza, which is, I mean, I kind of like, first I'm like, eh, but you know what? If anybody knows where the Remington Steakhouse was on uh, Little Road. Mm-hmm. Little I know where it is. Embassy, well, they took Remington Steakhouse all the way around to the to the uh, north end of that plaza. Is that what the they did? End. Wow. They took the whole end, and they're leaving, this is cool, they're leaving the restaurant the way it was. So when the kids, and that's where their, that's where their lunchroom and not because it's going to be, oh, because very nice. it's going to be their green space. It looks like the, it's, it's just like, it's old antique The kids are going to have an absolute blast. So. Oh, that's so neat. I'm but, glad we're closing yeah, our show I, with that. I just that. wanted to, I'm going to throw it out there because I know we were there yesterday and the lady's like, you know what? We could, we need more kids. 
Yeah. They want more kids. Yeah. They want more kids. Well, we should do, awesome. we should continually bring that up, you know, during our shows. And as we continue to grow our audience, thanks to everybody that is out there with us, you know, we'll be able to spread that word for that yeah. school. That's, that's really awesome. Yeah. I want to, I want to have, um, Dr. Carolyn Scott or Celeste, um, Keller in because we met with Miss Scott yesterday and she's the bomb. This lady, if I had a teacher like that growing up, I'd be way further than I am. So, but uh, yeah, we'll have them on and, and see if they'll they'll do it. I'd like to get a uh, an interview with Mr. Pepin. Let's do it. He's I've worked in his facilities over there in Tampa several times with mm -hmm. Julie and Steve Weintraub. So it's it's a really it's a really cool place. Well, let's do it. We'll get them Absolutely. on. That'll be great. So it looks like our show is coming to a close. It's well, been a very happy show. Before we go, yes, you know we have a few more tickets to that wedding oh, bridal show. Where's my tickets? What happened to my at, tickets? Um, I had my there. tickets for the they're bridal up there show. Somewhere. Yep. If it's you, at, it's at uh, oh, the Buck Stadium. This weekend. This weekend, twelve to four. And for brides, we're giving how many do we have left? How many tickets? Um, I think I have four left. Maybe oh. five. Maybe five. So it's. What the ticket is is for the bride, but the the bride's got to pay for the the, the entourage, but mm -hmm. the bride gets in, so we have tickets. That's pretty cool for the bridal yep. show. Yep. Oh yeah! And all they've got to do is email you, and I'm going to put your email up right okay. now. There's your email. There you go, Barbara so at, bar um, at mychambertv.com. Yep. Or go to mychambertv.com and click on the uh, contact us there, and then just email us through that as well. Either That's way perfect. works. Perfect, perfect. But this has been a good show. I know. And let me just recap real quickly. We had Debbie Dawson with It's Your Home Magazine. And in fact, during the break, we've just discovered we have more new things already coming out. Yep. And we also had uh, Nick Agostino from the Pretzel Factory. That and is the I bomb. have to tell you, these were so good, I couldn't help but get into my uh, <laughs> demonstrating <laughs> mode and eating mode. These are stuffed so chock full of goodies inside. You have to go over there. They're over on Old 54 in Newport Ritchie. You must go there because, I mean, you really taste these are baked and you taste the pretzel in them. Everything's baked fresh every single day. We're going to have them back. I'm already thinking about a platter to order for when my kids come down and we start to have some parties going on. Well, I guess that's it for me for right now. Uh, we will be here next Wednesday. We have a fabulous show planned then. Yes. We have the Palm Harbor Chamber of Commerce coming on board and Lanya Berger from Arthur Murray Palm Harbor, which is my own dance studio. So you'll have to tune in and see what's happening around our town. And then we just have, I think the whole, the whole month and part of August is booked. If you'd like to be on the show, if you haven't joined a, ch a chamber, please do so. If you, have a, if you are a chamber member, you want to come on the show, all you have to do is give us a call. Write me at Barbara at MyChamberTV.com. Tune in every Wednesday. We're here live and unrehearsed, just like today, at 12.30 p.m. Eastern Time. And then after the show, within a reasonable amount of time, John does get our shows up on archived. So if you go to MyChamberTV.com, you can see all the shows that we've ever done so far. And it's growing in leaps and bounds, and we couldn't do it without you. So I want to thank you very, very much for your support. Keep liking us on Facebook and share it all you like. And I will see you next week, same time, same place. Have a wonderful, beautiful, and safe week. Take care and God bless.